the only unbeaten sides in the league, faced off at the Parc des Princes this week and after dropping points against Montpellier last weekend, Paris had won convincingly against Bayern Munich in midweek. In the league, however, Unai Emery was looking to return to winning ways, knowing that Monaco were breathing down their necks. Just like Gouvernex men sat in third after their terrific start to the campaign and sporting the fourth best attack in the league. But it didn't take long for Paris to open the mark and what a goal! A superb free kick by Neymar. The Brazilian in tremendous form. And what a shot that was. Then after a phenomenal build-up play and a great pass by Neymar, it was Cavani who poked in the second. El Matador's eighth goal of the season. And after their penalty spat two weeks ago, all seemed well between Neymar and Cavani. 2-0 quickly became 3-0 inside half an hour for Paris. This time it was right back Thomas Meunier who got forwards well and steered in a Julian Draxler cross. Easy, far too easy for Paris Saint-Germain. Bordeaux did pull one back and it wasn't the ugliest of goals as Paris didn't clear the ball properly. It fell to Pilinar who drove forward, got rid of Verratti, played in Nicolas de Preville who squared it for Sankare who just had to steer it in. His fourth goal of the season and he won't score many more difficult goals like that. But after pulling one back, Bordeaux soon found themselves three goals down yet again. A needless handball gifting a penalty to Neymar, who was on penalty duties this week and steered it past the goalkeeper. Mm. 4-1, but the pick of the lot still to come. Mbappe to Draxler and what a finish. The German with a very convincing performance at the Parc des Princes. Sensational shot. Five-one at half time. The first time in their history that Paris had scored five before the break. And it was soon six as Mbappe steered in after the break. All three of Paris's superstars scoring once again in the French top flight. At the end of the match, Bordeaux had a chance to bring the score down. Meunier fouling Cafu. A clear penalty, good decision by the referee. Up stepped Malcolm, who blasted it past and gave Bordeaux some consolation at the end of the game. Malcolm's fourth of the season. But nothing to dampen the spirits of the Paris fans. Paris move three points clear at the top of the table and keep their distance with Monaco. The Parisians a seemingly unstoppable force in France. They also remain the only unbeaten team in the league.